there are basically three strategies that your body has to try and defend its body weight. The first one is, when you try to lose weight, you get hungry. The longer you stay on your diet and the more weight you lose, the more your body is going to try to get the weight back by making you hungry, by increasing your appetite, by even increasing your liking for foods that you might normally not want. The second thing that always happens when people lose weight is your metabolism slows down. And that's again your body trying to conserve calories. But there's also a third mechanism that happens. As we start losing weight, we become more fuel efficient. And what that basically means is that we can now do the same amount of physical work with fewer calories. So when you put the three mechanisms together, you've got the perfect combination of biological responses that are going to protect your body from losing more weight, which is why people reach the plateau. But not only that, it sets you up for putting the weight back on. For some people, lifestyle management alone is quite reasonable and quite effective. We also know there's a huge, huge uh, portion of patients that need more than, than lifestyle intervention. And I think that that's something that uh, well-trained expert uh, in this area can provide. There are resources to help you to keep that weight off. And it's not willpower. It's got to be something different such as bariatric surgery, medications, or cognitive behavioral therapy. It is truly a value then to seek medical attention, whether it's your primary care physician or whether you get referred to a subspecialty clinic for weight management. There's nothing wrong with getting that professional help. 